What's up soloist community, the soloist here. Welcome back to another video. In this one, we're taking a look at Last of Us gameplay. Uh, I haven't looked at anything as far as Last of Us for quite a while now, since the leaks. I wanted to watch some of the gameplay trailers and all that, but again, the leaks happen, the rumors happen, uh, they pushed the game back a year, now they brought it back. So meanwhile, while all of that was happening, I just disconnected entirely from Reddit, um, from all the groups that I was um, a part of for Last of Us. And the reason being is because a lot of them, uh, you know, the groups were cracking down on anyone that was providing spoilers to those communities. I did not want to be uh, spoiled. Last of Us is a game for me that I've played uh, you know, religiously from 2014, I played the remastered. I didn't buy the PS3 version. My friend had put me on. And so, um, you know, now that it's two weeks away uh, from the actual release of part two, I thought it'd be great for me now to watch some of the official Last of Us release content on the Naughty Dog channel. So no spoilers in that way. I'm not watching a review. This isn't something where I can get necessarily spoiled. I know what I'm supposed to know. So I've been lucky enough to this point not to be spoiled by anything. So um, yeah, without further ado, let's check it out. This is the last, I believe, gameplay um, that they showed us. And uh, yeah, I'll be re reacting to it and obviously giving my two cents at the end. So let's check it out. Let's go. Last of Us Part 2 inside the gameplay. Let's go. God damn, you better reload that quick. Oh, that's dope. That's dope. The bloaters, man. Oh my god. Part Oh 
I like this, man. Right. So, a couple things. The first thing I'm thinking about when I'm seeing these things is relating it to The Last of Us Factions, which apparently will be a separate game in and of itself. So I don't want to dive too much into that. But when I see these things here and I understand that Last of Us, rather Naughty Dog, are going to have a separate game for it, I could only imagine that these mechanics and these this philosophy that they have will in turn be interpreted into the gameplay of the Factions player. Now, the jumping, that is something that is very interesting. I understand the state of play of, of being on the ground. I would love to see that integrated, but there's so much so far uh, that I could take from, you know, how they approach it. Let, not specifically, you know, the mechanics themselves, but how they're approaching the game, you know, allowing us to have that insight really makes me, uh, you know, think much in the world of the multiplayer, right? what is possible considering the frame of mind that they had going into it. So a lot of things are spinning in my head right now. I really do like the direction of the game. A lot of criticism has went towards Last of Us for some of the spoilers that has been released. But what I do understand, and I want to jump into the, back to the video, what I do understand is that they've created a much more immersed world, uh, you know, that you cannot finish on the first playthrough that there's so much there much in the world much in the way of skyrim that if you were to look at skyrim um and have um uh, you know let's say an hour or two hours of the game ruined for you that wouldn't be enough for you to give cast judgment on the entire game so for me personally uh i really still believe even though you know some of you guys might hold out and say the game is terrible based off what you heard I really feel that we still have to play the game for ourselves. And a lot of the work, especially with the philosophy that they have, you have to play it, right? You have to play it for yourself. And this is what we've told all our friends. This is what we've told anybody that asked us about Last of Us. We said, you have to play it for yourself. I can't give you, I can't make it, how do I say this? By me telling you, won't do it justice. And I think that is the ultimate appraisal of a game like this. And so even though we've saw and heard spoilers, or some people heard and saw spoilers, those of what was spoiled, that of what was spoiled, cannot do the game justice in a negative light, right? So in other words, enough rambling. I just want to get back to this, but I'm really, really excited. Again, we're two weeks away, so um, man, can't wait. Mm-hmm. Last thing, playing this on Grounded is going to be wild. Wild. We know how it was in part one. Wild.
Right, I like that. I like that. That moment there, before I let Neil Druckmann go back in, that moment is so Last of Us, right? When you come down the stairs and you are literally like, you saw them for a moment go through a, mirror, a window and you're just waiting for them to come in and you're just like, okay, what is the best thing for me to do? That is something with Last of Us that I can't really explain it, but they, they touch on that in a way that I haven't really felt in, in other games. Like you see them, you know they're going to come inside, and you're like, okay, should I? You know, and you have a moment, and you hear the footsteps creaking as he's stepping towards you, and you're like, okay, I got to act now. Last of Us, Naughty Dog does so well with that. Damn, the fire is so real. I like that. Wow. I like that. Especially when you play on grounded guys, like, you know that if you miss a bullet, you miss, in Last of Us Part 1, I'm talking, if you were to shoot and you miss, that, that, that uh, feeling, that, that stomach sinking feeling you would get because you knew you needed that bullet and, you know, just the, the lack of abundance that was in the game and understanding the decisions you're going to have to make. And having to, for me, repeat certain levels over and over again because I, I used all my bullets in the last area. And, you know, I have to rely on my ability to to throw things around. You know what I mean? To to duck corners, to, have, to be seen by only one enemy, and maybe I can take them out before, you know, like, that is what I like about it. And, you know, the fact that they noted in this by saying... Uh, you know, you cannot fully upgrade everything. I think that is the right way to go about it, you know. So, again, really loving what I'm hearing with this uh, state of play gameplay analysis.
so there we go there we have it guys that's last of us to the gameplay um you know i've given my thoughts all the way through i'm still very excited for this as i said there's other people that have seen more spoilers seen things they're not quite happy with it great for them but for me personally i have never been more excited for the release of a game ever um i have awaited this game for many years as a lot of you watching this has waited many years and that excitement will not go away for another two weeks maybe when this game actually gets released and i'll probably be even more excited at that when the game does um i will be streaming every single moment of the story on this channel so guys if you're interested in that subscribe i've already pre-ordered the game i'm looking forward to playing it the moment it finishes downloading uh that's what i will be doing for that time period so if that at all interests you guys go ahead and subscribe but as far as this gameplay and the philosophy it's nothing short of what I expected from Naughty Dog. Um, that's the mindset I expected them to go in to the game. That's the mindset I expected them to develop the game. And it seems they've done just that. Um, I'm looking forward to being disappointed. I'm looking forward to being um, wowed in many aspects of the game. And that's what awaiting a game like this does. You know? So, that all said, again, I'm really excited I know uh, many of you guys are as well. You guys let me know below what you guys think without leaving any spoilers. I'd really appreciate that. Um, what you are most excited about for Last of Us Part 2. And let me know if you've actually pre-ordered it yet. And if not, are you going to after this video? So, appreciate all that guys. These soloists, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.